from Detroit to the nations, you are listening to the world's number one Christian station, Worship Center Radio, the platform of champions. I'm here with one of our newest member to the family, newest member to the team, Prophet hey, hey. Sterling. Hey, hey, <laughs> good to be here. Yes, you can hear his program every Saturday uh, at 4.30. Four, at no, four. at 4. Yes, I'm sorry. At 4. At 4 o'clock. Uh, his program is called Crown Culture. Yes, Crown to Culture. And online with me is, in one moment, <laughs> online with us is Prophet Blaine. Who has joined in through uh, telephone? Hey, Prophet. Good afternoon, Dr. Rada and Prophet Sterling. How are you all today? Hey, hey, we, <laughs> we good. good. We can't hear you though, but we doing good. Okay, I think we can hear you I, now. Yeah, I can hear you now. I apologize. I have a little bit of a bad connection at the moment. Uh, you know. Oh no. But, uh, <laughs> Go ahead, Prophet. I'm sorry. No, no. Go ahead. Well, I'm excited because I have my two. Team members, the Bible said a three four cord isn't easily broken. Oh, amen. And amen. so I had to call in the prophets, and uh, we're excited about this end time move of God. So we're gonna um, kind of get to the point of why we're gathered here today. Here at Worship Center Radio, we've had some awesome move of God uh, through our program hosts, our programs, yeah. uh, through the prayer, the fasting, the events. Um, I don't want to say events, but special programs we put on to be a blessing to the body of Christ. And because the Lord has blessed us with over 400 downloads, we are now in... 1,000. Uh, I'm sorry? 400,000. Thanks, thanks yes, Prophet. 400,000. 400, thank you. <laughs> 400,000. 400,000 downloads. We've expanded now to DWCN, which is our television network. Yes. yes. Uh, we've expanded to Monroe. Yes. Yes. And we're going to just keep doing what God tells us to do. We're looking to head to Texas in May. Praise oh, God. Amen, amen. All right. So uh, we have reached a point to where we are now excited about inviting our listeners and our viewers to partake in this global move of God through the uh, 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 network of media. Yeah. We're doing media outreach. Yes. And so, I still want to give a little bit of, uh, for uh, talk a little bit about to our views and our listeners of your experience since you've been here at Worship Center Radio. Oh, wow. Um, my experience has just been wonderful. Um, I, I knew from the beginning, well, I've always had a desire to be a part of media and um, just reach the world through the airwaves. You know, that was something that I've always had a desire for. So once I got here, I just knew that um, I was around some really good, godly people. You know, I was raised in um, around different types of godly people. You know, so it's really good when you, when you hear and see people really um, listen to the word of God 100. I gotta say, we absolutely operate on faith. 
and that's one thing that I have been that I have been um, privileged to see and witness um, just how God has just been moving, how things have just been flowing and happening with God just doing it. He's been doing his thing. Well, we're excited about the outpouring of the Spirit. And truly, we are a company that walk by faith and not by sight. Amen. We are not a company that did the normal thing. Yeah. You know, because we yeah. were talking about loans and right, capital. Right. Our capital was the seeds of the words yes. being planted in the heavens. Amen. Exactly. <laughs> Repeating the prophetic decrees yes. that God gave us to say and um, just moving out by faith. Yes. And here we are today expanding and growing. I have Prophet Blaine on because he's not only a part of Worship Center Radio, but he's also a, a president over Holy Hopes, You're which right, is another right. company. So Worship Center Radio is a part of an umbrella um Worship Center Network mm-hmm. is the parent company right. over the individual companies. Right. And so God has blessed us to reach milestones. And I want Prophet Blaine to talk about this because the conception of everything we see was in his heart. Mm-hmm. And then Juan and I just joined with him and 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 bringing these things to pass. Uh, Juan is in the studio as well. Uh, he's waving. He's, well, he's, yeah. <laughs> He's a little bit busy, busy taking care of the natural <laughs> aspect with some pizza. But, <laughs> but he is saying hello. So Juan implements. He uh, he's a production manager. He does you know the radio and he does the live stream for us. And Blaine is our product. Excuse me, Prophet Blaine is our product developer, and he handles all the. Uh, he's like. You know, we joke and say peeking in the brain, but he's not taking over the world in a bad way. Right, right. <laughs> he wants to take over the, the kingdoms the of this world, right? right, right, that, that, right. That, that mountain, the kingdom of this world for the kingdom of God. Isn't that right, right Prophet? Absolutely. And I apologize. Uh, I'm having a little bit of a bad signal issue here with you guys today, and I do apologize for that. I'll try and fix it momentarily. Um, but yes, you know, Dr. Rutter, you, um, you mentioned, or I heard a little bit of you mentioned, about the fact that, uh, you know, the, the Lord had given me part of the radio station and, and little bits and pieces of the network itself. And there's so many components that are that are still um, in the heart and that are still in the planning process um, and even still in a growth process. But there is so much more that God has given for Worship Center Network to do um, that, you know, just it requires, some, it requires an influx of funds. Um, there's so many new technologies and new things that God is going to use Worship Center Network to do. So many cool things that, you know, I can't even get into because of the technology behind it. Um, but there is definitely a, a new thing that's going to come of this. You know, technology changes so rapidly. Um, but God is really using technology um, to his advantage and to spread his word and his love um, all across the planet. You know, never before... In the history of man, has it been that communication could be instantaneous as it is right now? Mm-hmm. We can reach the whole planet within seconds. And, you know, right now the signal is, you know, traveling to Asia and, and South America and Africa and, and Europe within seconds. And, you know, time zones don't matter and, and space and time doesn't matter. But the people can hear the word of God so quickly, um, and which is such a blessing that the Lord could have chosen a people such as us. To be able to uh, to put this into in, into in existence. Awesome, awesome. Um, amen, Prophet Blaine. While while you were talking, Sterling is so so good. He was just talking about um, where do I go here, Juan? Come come show me, babe. Where do I go? Mm hmm. Uh, Prophet Sterling had a great idea. We're going to um, pull up the stats here and go over a few of the countries we reach. Yeah, and yeah. this is just through Facebook. Actually, Prophet Blaine has the stats for how many people have went to our uh, actual website. Right. Uh, he has his computer with him. Maybe he can talk about that in a minute. As well as he has... Um, uh, well, we already gave the stats. It's over 400,000 right, downloads. Right. And when we say downloads, these are... Our platforms that people go to, right. uh, such as uh, Ustream, iTunes, yep, TuneIn, tune yeah, right. um, um, Ustream, YouTube, um, YouTube. I think that. Um, yes. We said TuneIn. 
you yeah, yeah. and you oh and now we're adding soundcloud to our family oh, of products great, great, okay great. so we do have that but thank you so much awesome yes so okay thank you Juan so, has so pulled the, it up for me so the reach of worship so the reach of worship center network has really from from its initial inception or from worship center radio from its initial inception god has really just blessed the network um to just go into the corners of the earth from from the good old city of Detroit and just yeah. share the gospel with people. Um, you know, we continuously hear a testimonies of how people have given their lives to God on Monday night. Uh, and, you know, even throughout the week, we continuously hear testimonies of how people are encouraged. Um, we've had people call in for prayer that, you know, aren't really familiar with um, with God in the, in the facets of, of prophecy and the prophetic. You know, Dr. Rutter, you you've now seen a, a few times actually where where the Lord has used you to prophesy into somebody's life, prophesy life where there was no life. And you know, sometimes they're taken back, like, how did you know that? But that is the beauty of of the awesomeness and the greatness of who God really is, that he has all this creativity and then all this knowledge. And that he now has put a plan together and many of the networks that are yet still to come, um, you know that that the Lord has given just worship center network, and you know, su- and, and you know, suppose other entities as well. Amen. Uh, go ahead, Prophet Sterling. Well, I just wanted to um, really get into the fact that um, just on Facebook alone, we've between. Um, oh, I. <laughs> thank you. Thank I didn't you. mean to do that through camera. <laughs> but just on Facebook alone, I mean, we have reached. 51,305 individuals and that's just on their um on their computers that's the men between the ages of 18 and 24 and that's our that's our largest audience right there and just on mobile devices alone 8744 mobile devices have a, uh, connected with us and you know just to to see where we're sitting here in the middle of Detroit and um there is there are people who who hear us on a a global level i mean the the thing about it is are are most reached we're we're in we're in the United States but we also reach a lot of people in Jordan a lot of people in Pakistan a lot of people in South Africa and that's something that's really important like we are sitting here in in someone's backyard not necessarily but in the community's backyard and we're reaching um globally um, people who who may not even know about Jesus, and this is really what the kingdom is here to do. Secondly, um, India, they're, they are in the process of just now allowing their um, country or the certain countries within within that area are just now getting internet and they're getting the speeds at which we're operating under and that's something that's amazing too a whole nother market is expanding with this online internet radio online television um it it is really um going to go beyond what we can even imagine right now. Amen. And I want to say something. Um, Prophet Sterling mentioned a number. I think it's important to say that this reach was from March 8th to March 14th. The 5,300 and... Uh, 5, 51,305. Thank you for correcting me. I get, I'm getting too excited. No, it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> was for one week that they connected us to Facebook. That does not include our website, people, that connects on our website. Because yeah. I remember one week, Blaine had, we did a count for a day, and there was over 7,000 people that connected with our website for wow. one day. Wow. We've had close to 200,000 views on YouTube, okay? And so we're yet, our outreach is, is is powerful, but what's even more powerful is the programs that we provide. Our yes. quality programs, 
uh, uh, giving of the truth of the word of God. They're biblically based. They're biblically founded. Uh, these speakers are anointed. They're unique and creative. You're not going to hear a lot of duplication here on this station. Uh, we never beg for money. Never. Yeah. We always um, allow, and when I say beg, because I'm about to introduce you to this new concept we just came up right, with. Right. So we, we've we never, when Juan and Blaine and I sat down and first talked about this company, we had made a vow that we would not prostitute or allow prostitution of the gifts on here. Mm -hmm. And we would not put people in such a uh, feeling of strain to give. Mm -hmm. We made our prices affordable. And we have always left it up to the viewers and listeners to choose if they want to donate. Yes. However, today, we are imploring the people of God to partake in the blessing of giving and yes. supporting this radio station. Yes, which is a wonderful thing to do. Yeah, I, I felt it was a wonderful opportunity to help us expand the, uh, uh, our, our media outreach for the Kingdom of God advancement. Yes. As I stated, we are, um, we're we in this office and we're looking to expand because we have young people like Prophet Sterling coming on. We have people excited to want to partake we want to be able to Amen. financially provide for them uh we desire to get more equipment we need some more updated equipment there are some uh a few other um well blaine knows everything uh, you know we with some furnishings we want to do yeah, yeah. there is some other products and services that's what i needed to advance technology yeah. wise and so we we're desired to walk in the spirit of excellence in all that we say and do in our program hosts and our programs as well as our technology. Exactly. And we realize that it does cost. So this is an invitation to be a part of the sewing. Wow. <laughs> and I mean I, I I myself am a chill forgiver when I know that it's good ground and I can testify that this is definitely good ground. I mean the work that I've seen um, and just done through the works that the individuals who are part of Worship Center Radio. And it's just, it's amazing to, you know, know you guys and to just be a part of this, you know. Thank you all. Thank you. <laughs> and we're excited because some owners of companies, they hire people to do the work. We have minimum staff because we are the staff. <laughs> Isn't that right, Prophet Blaine? I was going to say, I'm not sure what staff you were referring to. <laughs> <laughs> well, it started off with the three of us forever in a day. And then the Lord, would he, he has had to. And so uh, at this point, um, we do desire the help of our listeners and viewers. We want to thank you, first of all. For taking out time of your busy schedule yes. to be a part of our station and listening uh, through your TuneIn app or going on our website at wcrdetroit.net. Um, we, we're grateful for you taking out the time to listen. We pray that the programs are a blessing to you because we really pray about who should be here and you know, who we allow in the air. We're very, very serious about souls. Yes. So um, we don't have a gimmick today. You know, some people say, well, if you sow, you get this, you get that. This is this is what you get from us. You get an opportunity to help us win souls for the kingdom. Amen. 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 And if we ever have specials, we'll let you know, but it's not going to be based on giving. We on, on your giving, we don't want to do any type of gimmicks. That's not who yeah. we are. Yeah. Uh, we just enjoy being able to be a blessing to you, and we're asking you to help us to continue to be a blessing to you all yeah. that are yeah. listening and, and, and hearing. To fulfill I mean, the listen great and commission. Yeah. Come on, talk to about it. To fulfill the great commission. That's all we want to do. Um, help save souls through the the next wave of outpouring and you know we've throughout time we've seen revivals we've seen um generations raised up who who they would go and they would travel and then we saw the the television you know um preachers rise up and now this internet and online radio and marketing and television is it's the next outpouring for the next generation i mean um i know I've I've sat here a few times and I I wasn't even able to put my phone down. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, and I get these notifications all day long. You know, so internet is definitely the next outpouring and wave that the kingdom needs to attach itself to to save souls who they've never even met before. That's the wonderful thing about and it. And this is so exciting. <laughs> you know, it's just like for every soul that's one. 
from um, the blessing and the giving that you've given. And we're not just talking about the money. No. We appreciate your prayers. We appreciate you sharing our programs mm -hmm. on your um, uh, media sites. Social, uh, social media. media. Thank yes. you, sweetie. Social media sites, uh, resharing our programs, helping us get the word of the Lord out throughout your community, throughout this world. Uh, we appreciate uh, the praise. We appreciate hearing the testimony. Please continue to share with us testimonies of how this station has been a blessing to you for our own encouragement and so that we can continue to pray for you as a staff. We have been getting a prayer request, and Blaine and I do pray. We touch and agree and pray. Yeah, yeah. And for those who have come in the office and, uh, and sown seed, why myself and um, Blaine have prayed over those seeds, and we've watched them multiply. Amen. You know, we give God to glory for all that's done here. Amen. Okay, God Amen. gets the glory. But I'm saying we take our time to pray and bless because we realize that every seed sowing into this ministry uh, is precious. Yes. We don't know what yes, sacrifice people made to, to be a blessing to us so we could be a blessing to others, but we treasure every seed. Mm -hmm. but, uh, Prophet Blaine. Yes, ma'am. What would you like to add? You know, I, I think it's important. I want to share with the people two things. I was just sitting here thinking about, just listening to what, what you were saying. And the first thing that I, uh, you know, oh, wow. just Okay. So the first thing I want to say is I want the people to know that when you sow, uh, no matter, you know, whether it's $500, whether it's $1,000, whether it's $2, whatever you sow, you know, uh, people don't realize that they're sowing into destiny and they're sowing into purpose. Um, and so even when you, even when you give today, you, tomorrow, when, and when this program is archived, when you give in that moment, you're, you're sowing into destiny and sowing into purpose, and you're a part of those souls that get one for Jesus. You are part of that, that uh, you know, the radio station as it grows. Um, and it's not just that it was only your one money that was important. It, 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 the intent of giving it to is just as important. The, 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 the blessing that you get from that as God watches over you is just as important. And so I want to encourage those that as the Lord leads them to give, no amount is to no amount is insignificant. No amount is too small. Uh, you know, with again, as I said, whether it is two dollars or give five dollars, but don't do nothing. Don't you know, I, I'm, I'm just going to be straightforward and say, don't do nothing and give up your own blessing. Don't do nothing and, and give up your own breakthrough. Don't, don't do nothing. Give something and, and watch it multiply in your life. Watch God move on your behalf. And, you know, many a times when we give into ministries, and I know there's been case, times where I have not wanted to give and the Lord told me to give and I gave and I've watched it multiply whether it was instantaneously or whether it was within a few days. God watches over those seeds. He knows where we give. He knows where we have been obedient when he has spoken. And Amen. so I don't, like to, I don't like to use Scripture to force people to give. I don't like to use Scripture to get people to feel guilty into giving. You make the choice yes. on whether you want your breakthrough. You make the choice on what blessing you can and cannot receive. You make the choice on what it is you want to step out in faith on and give. And I guarantee you, I'm feeling the, the, the prophetic right now, I guarantee you, you take out that step in faith as you feel led to give and you watch God move on your behalf. I guarantee it, you watch God move on your behalf. Amen. That's powerful. Now, you know what? <laughs> I'm, I'm, Okay, see, this is really serious to me, okay? This is how powerful the anointing of God is. While we're on air, I got a text from somebody asking, what else do we need in Monroe? Wow. wow. I, and I know they're not listening or watching. Amen. But that's just how it is when the word goes out, it's universal. This person is not watching because they're bedridden right now. Wow. They text to say, what else do you... Hallelujah! Thank you, Jesus. Monroe is one of our stations. Yeah. We have a station in Monroe, Michigan, outside of Detroit. Okay, so God is real. Yeah. And that's why I said we, we, we carefully thought about this give. Yeah. We call it a give-a-thon. Now, I'm going to tell you a little bit about it, and then Prophet Sterling wants to give a testimony. We, we said all this to say the give-a-thon is... 24 hours. We're asking for you all to come together and help us within 24 hours to meet a goal. Yes. The goal we set was $10,000. Yes. That's not a lot of money. No. But we encourage you to go beyond that. 
You're not limited to that. But that's our goal. We set for ten grand. Yeah. Okay. I'm asking you. You know what? Can, what if, can, if I can just add something, Doctor, and I apologize. I didn't mean to cut you off. But when I was sitting here earlier, you know. For those of you that don't know Dr. Rhoda well and you don't know her on a daily basis, some of us do know her like that. And we know that things can happen in a matter of seconds from, hey, the Lord told me to do this, and five seconds later we're all doing it. So I, was, I know this was a move from God because when I was sitting working on the image and the graphic for this, you know, just to encourage people to give, I actually, um, I didn't put it on the graphic, but I thought I would share nevertheless. Um, what it was, I heard uh, the words, wait, I have to find them. Uh, hold on a second. Um, it, was something, it was something to the lines of join us and help build the future. Mm, I like that. Join us and help build the future. So take this as you're building the future seed, if you want to call it that. Take this as your miracle seed, your miraculous seed. For that healing that you're looking for, for that health that you're believing God for, that just seems like it is so impossible, use this as your miracle seed. So for your house, so for your car, so for your your miracle, so to release that debt. I just I, I just trust that as you give here today, that God will use that to bring about a massive manifestation of a miracle in each and every single person's life. I'm not about just giving money just to give money. I'm about giving money with a purpose. If you're giving money to this network, you're giving it with a purpose. We are and we always will be about reaching souls. We are and we always will be about touching lives. We are and always will be about representing the faith and the love and the heart of God. We are and always will be the, the, the station and the company that always holds hold, hold God, hold God's name up high. We all have and always will be a company that gives God all the glory. So if you can just sow into glory, imagine the glory of God being, being sustained like that all the time. If you can uh, uh, anoint into that, if you can sow into that, imagine what kind of a manifestation you will have and God blessing you and coming through for you from that anointing that is saturated at Worship Center Radio. And I am a, I'm, I'm a testament to the fact that miracles happen at Worship Center Radio. We've seen limbs grow. We've seen miracles upon miracles happen. And I, I, I dare you to test God on that. I dare you. Amen. Amen. Um, I, I've really, um, I've really been blessed. I'd like to quickly tell my testimony of how I ended up here at Worship Center Radio. Um, I moved back here from California after finishing college and, um, you know, I was, I was in a, a, a really a good job in a, a very large gym chain. Um, I'm really into fitness and things like that. I was in a manager position and um, I couldn't understand why God was uh, God, God just had me um, uneasy about where I was. And um, the the degree field that I that I work in is audio engineering and I was looking for some type of media or some type of engineering um, to get into. And um, as soon as I walked into Worship Center Radio, I knew that this is where I was supposed to be. And um, since then, I have been volunteering my time. Um, I think it's been about a month now that um, I've, I've been volunteering my time. And I, I had to leave my job. I quit my job. Not only first, first time I quit my job, I was like, hey, I got to go. You know, and then I'm like, okay, God, I'm worried about money. I'm worried about finances right now. I you've I got you know car notes and all things, and I know you're a provider. And he goes, well, um, you know where I told you to be, and you know what I told you to do. So my job, they call me back. They say, look, we need you. We got a goal we're trying to reach, and um, we we need you to come back. We're gonna give you the schedule you want. We're gonna give you a raise, and everything will be all right. So now I have the job that I need, and then I'm still with Worship Center Radio. 
And that wasn't even the blessing. The blessing was when I walked in there, God was like, okay, this is still not where you're supposed to be, even though they will compromise to accommodate where I've put you and, and told you to go. So that very same day, I had to quit again. And they're like, I don't understand. We've given you everything that you've wanted, but you can't come work for us you know we're giving you everything <laughs> and I'm like no I, I have to be obedient to God so I still quit my job and I've been here at worship center radio almost every day if not every other day and um just this just today I was I was getting getting to that point again you know I was like okay <laughs> All right, God, what are you going to do? It's been it's been a month and I've been living off of off of the fruits of a month ago and I, I haven't done anything to, you know, secure this next month, God. And just today, right before we go on air, this is not something that I can plan, y'all. This is not something that I can make up. I would not lie to you on this air, but I got a deposit in my bank account. I got a deposit in my bank account that I have no idea where it came from. Hallelujah. But I know you, that God is a provider. So I just want to let you know that if you sow your time, whether you sow your finances, whether you sow um, a, a share, a prayer, anything, a praise, if you, if you sow that into this ministry, you will get your return because I am a living testimony of that. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank so. you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You know, and you covered exactly what I wanted to say. Uh, for those that can, please receive the word of the Lord from Prophet Blaine. And for those that can't, please receive the word of the Lord from Prophet uh, Sterling. In my heart, I was just going to tell you, if you don't have money, so a praise for us. All day long, just begin to thank God for Worship Center Radio. Begin to thank God for Worship Center uh, Studios. So a praise. Hallelujah. So a testimony. Share with somebody else how you've been affected by this station. Go out. If, if, if you haven't heard any of the programs, go to WCRDetroit.net and just ask God to lead you to what program yeah. you need to be connected to at that moment. And I promise you, you're going to be blessed because we got some bad to the bone people up in <laughs> here we got some holy ghost field people that's on this station excuse me and i'm not just talking about our programs amen <laughs> <laughs> you do have the watchman's voice that's a little scary but you're gonna get some truth right you got prophet blaine you got myself dr Rhoda. you got prophet uh sterling uh you have uh love broke the chain which yes. deals with homosexuality in the church yes. giving a better understanding how to connect with this uh community yes you have uh, 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 Apostle Sharice. Yeah. Uh, Youth on Fire. Youth on Fire. Prophet Rudy Lewis. Pastor uh, Rudy. Past, oh, I'm sorry. Youth Pastor Rudy right, Lewis. Right, right. Uh, Apostle Sharice. Hers is um, Kingdom Vision. You have Not On My Watch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have uh, Angels of Melody here. Oh, you have Miracles For Me Now where yeah. there one day 80 souls got saved. Wow. 80 Amen. souls. Amen. From that program alone, Thank you, you have Jesus. marketplace connection for those that are in business yeah. and want to advance in the kingdom, both naturally and spiritually, with evangelist prophetess Linda Hunt. Uh, you have uh, believe again for those that feel lost, yeah. those that feel forsaken. It's really a ministry to the backslider and ministry to those who are. Uh, slowly going into a backsliding condition right, is to right. help you believe again with a, a Pastor Velma Biggers. You have a Zion Refuge Church yeah. that's definitely concentrated with marriages. You have a Church of the Living Waters yeah. that deals with the Seven Mountains, deals with a lot of the prophetic teachings that are out there, yeah. but their revelation is just powerful. Yeah. You have uh, the those who are love music lovers. We have uh, with uh, Anthony Howard. What is it? The Gospel Connect? No. Gospel music, the traditional, music, the traditional way. Yes. yes, and then we have Bishop Andre Woods, right. which is gospel connection. Praise right. God. Right. We have daily living, just to teach you how to live daily, naturally yeah. and spiritually, Amen. with Minister Cindy Davis. And I could go on and on because we have a lot of programs. We do have. Oh yes, we have uh, University. What is it? Um, Destiny, Destiny U. Destiny U with Rich Darnell. We have Iron Shop and Arm for yeah, those that need yeah. to be encouraged in ministry with uh, uh, Brother William. 
Hallelujah. We have, uh, oh Lord, it's so many in my mind. And we have some of those programs who are on in, in a recording stage. So they are uh, pretty much, uh, you'll hear some replays of their programs. We even have a legal service here for those who want to know. She's a Christian attorney. It's live and legal with attorney Yancey. Oh, I can't forget for the glamour and yes. beauty. Yes. Outwardly and inwardly. We have uh, Victoria Johnson that comes on Mondays at one praise god um it's just it's it's more i know a uh, sounds of victory with dr eberica uh who is an awesome man of god in texas who helps us to uh kind of walk a victorious life Amen. we have home for today and tomorrow with dr sandra o'neill awesome woman of god that does a lot of practical teaching to help us to get what we need to be in God so that we can be ready yes. for his return. Amen. And that's important. Um, we have a uh, set time of God's favor with prophetic and apostolic encouragement from our own apostle Velma Rosemont. We have widows with wisdom, yes. uh, which is ministry. Uh, I'm sorry, minister Mary. Edwards, mm -hmm. who was the wife of Eddie Edwards, which is Joy for Jesus. Is that correct, Juan? And so she's here, and she's helping widows and helping those to understand uh, uh, the plight of a widow, as well as giving the wisdom. The Amen. Bible said, let the older women teach the young. We have the wonderful, wonderful, wonderful Apostle Derek uh, Harris with the life show. Fun show. Very family oriented. <laughs> yeah. Just having a good old time in the Lord. Uh, and we have... Um, we can go up. We talked about crown culture with our own um, prophet Sterling. Uh, your hours come with First Lady Carol Codwell, awesome woman of God. And uh, pretty much I've went over everybody. John Sable is yet with us. He had he was hospitalized, but he's doing better. So Amen. he's going to come on live again. Good. And Good. we have many, 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 many more opportunities uh, uh, for you to hear the word of God. That's just a few of them. We do have spontaneous morning shows. So let me explain this show. <laughs> It is a Detroit-based show. Yeah. So we honor the city that we're in. And we talk yeah. about different issues like politic issues. And you hear some music. And it's a, it's a diversity show. Yeah. Um, if you want to know about Detroit. <laughs> that's where you want to come. That's where you want to come. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So we have a combination. You know, we're not. Uh, this is not a preachy type station right it's more of a teaching we do have some preaching here right, because right. uh zion refuge church do provide that but it's more of 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 information uh and, and you and helping you grow in every single area Amen. of your Amen. life i don't think there's an area that's not covered here yeah i mean we cover finances we cover basic needs eventually we're going to have insurance on here yeah. we're going to talk about vacations with your family just other things that i feel will be at uh, edifying um with our twcn um network we have some fun shows that's coming on there too um and you want to go to twcn.faith. I want to talk a little bit about that. We have biblical truths where we have different pastors that's going to come and share with you a different um, insight on the word, revelation on the word of God. We have banking is your business. I don't care what nobody say. Banking is your business. <laughs> you need to know how to invest your money. What's the best investment? Yeah. The, the true value for gold and silver yeah. and diamonds and the true value for liquid assets and things yeah. like that. We want to help you to know more about that. Of course, my show is on there. Yay for Jesus. We have <laughs> community outreach programs that's going to be going on here. We have something called the Christian Movie and Music Review. Yes, That's going to be fun because yeah. we're actually going to go to concerts and you guys will see one on the floor standing up doing stuff with com uh -huh. cameras. <laughs> <laughs> or you may see the camera crew, however, right, you know. Right. But um, we're going to be able to go to the concerts and 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 stream live and do some interviews before and after, before with the artists and after with the people who attended the concert, okay. give their opinion. Wow. Same thing with the movies. We'll set up, uh, you can join us for movie and dinner. We'll have dinner, get to know each other, go watch yeah. the movie, and afterwards have a booth, and you can talk about the movie. So we have real live reviews from real live people, right. you know. Yeah. So we want to give that. Um and then, of course, we have uh, Love Broke the Chain, some of our same program hosts that on radio, you'll start seeing them on TV, but they'll have different type of programs. Right. So right. 
Check out TWCN.Faith. Um, uh, End Time Mover God will be on it. Yes. Blaine and I want to do some fun stuff with that. Dr. Rhoda, A Time to Praise will be on it. Uh, we'll see what Prophet Sterling going to be doing with that <laughs> if he ain't running all over the place. Right. But this is our television network. We already have some programs on there. If you go to Featured Events and click on Featured Events, mm-hmm. you should be able to... Uh, um, Go to some of the past events. Now, our network is hasn't launched yet. It will be launching sometime this spring. We'll have a few shows up. From probably close. We our goal was April. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, why not share something with me about Dr. Eparica? So there's a few things we will have probably maybe later part of right. April, May. Right. But it should be full blown by June. So it's right. not up yet. Yeah, Brian is shaking his head. Yeah, so it's not up quite yet, but by June, before summer, around the last part of spring, right. we should be ready to go, okay? Right. But we're just letting you check it out and see what's going on. That we're not a people that's sitting around. There is. There's. If you go to featured events, that's what I want. Thank you for bringing me back to that. Click on featured events, and there are archives of events that we've already done through right. live stream. So that's kind of giving you a, some idea of what we're capable of doing. We're not a people that procrastinate. We didn't wait so we had the big sum lump of money to get things started. We had to walk by faith and not by sight and allow God to move us in the direction he wanted us to go. Mm-hmm. And we've done uh, the majority of what we could do with what we had. But to expand, we do want to extend the invitation to be a blessing. Amen. Amen. So I just wanted to go over a couple of things that we have. Prophet Blaine, are you still with us, Prophet? Yes, yes. Yes, ma'am. Is there some more things you want to share? No, not a, no. I'm I'm actually all right. I feel like the, you know, as far as my partaking uh, of the part, I feel like what I what I shared is what I shared. Okay, uh, awesome. It's now people, it's, it's now people's opportunity to uh, uh, sow that seed and trust God and watch Him move. If you're looking for that miracle and that blessing, sow that seed and you watch God move. I'm a testament that when there's times where you don't want to, unsure, don't feel like it, don't have it, or you're holding on to the law, it's just so it, and you watch God move on your behalf. I guarantee it. Glory to God. Amen. So I want to say this. Now you need to know where to go. <laughs> right. Let's start with that. So um, on Worship Center Radio, so you can do either Worship, W-O-R-S-H-I-P, C-E-N-T-E-R, radio.net, or do it the uh, abbreviated way, wcrdetroit.net. I want you to go on there. On our website, I want you to look on the right-hand side of the website. It says, Give Now, Unlock Your Blessing. Click on that uh, image, and when you click on that image, it will lead you into our uh, ability to give, our PayPal account where you can give right there. Okay? So, um, also... We have a campaign that's up. I will be uh, listing that campaign on uh, Worship Center Radio uh, Facebook page as well as our other social media uh, pages and transferring that to Blaine, and he'll probably put it up somewhere on the site. But we do have our campaign where it shows our goal amount and it shows different amounts you can give. And if you desire to and you say, hey, I don't have it, but I want to be a part, the Bible said he gets seeds to the sower. So we, we say this. We know that the word of God is in your mouth that you can plant into the heaven. So you're righteous, and I mean righteous. Yes. <laughs> Let's be clear. Righteous declaration and decrees for the blessings of the Lord that make it rich and add it no sorrow with it to be upon our station, our business. We encourage you to do so. Amen. Righteous. Amen. Amen. With no guile in your heart or jealousy. Just righteous. Righteous. <laughs> Just pure. Yeah. Just keep it real. Pray. I have to say that because we're we're openly inviting people to pray. But those are the prayers we're inviting. We're not inviting unrighteous prayers. Just the righteous ones. Amen. And so uh, testimony. If you have a testimony, there should be somewhere. I think maybe a contact us. You can send a testimonies or either go over our page and give a testimony. Uh, I'm going to reshare this um, program 
on my social media page as well as Worship Center Radio. You say, I want help? Share. Yeah. Share this program yeah. on your social media pages. Twitter, uh, Pinterest. Uh, um, what's the other one everybody loves? Instagram. Yeah, Instagram. Um, grab a, 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 you can probably get our image some kind of way and send it. Yeah. Send it out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You can share. You can share our campaign on your page. Let people know about it. That's another way you can do. And just like I said, 24 hours give God praise. The reason why I'm Amen. explaining 24 hours, because why I ask the excellent question that I want to answer for somebody else that may ask. We are not the regular telethon. We will not be on here every hour asking for money. We're not doing that. No. What we are saying is as a collective body, we're coming together to give what we have. Yeah. Whether it's praise, whether it's worship, whether it's a righteous prayer, declaration and decree for us, Amen. whether it's the finances or your time where you say, how else can I be a blessing? Yeah. Blessing. Hey, we got cars down here, right? Well, we still got some cars. You want to get it out in the community and say, hey, check this radio station out. Please come get the cars. We're, we can e inbox us, email us, and we'll let you know our location. Go ahead. Well, oh, why said we'll even mail it to you. Amen. Yeah. Share a, a, a prophet Sterling second and say, We'll mail you some cars. You may say, Hey, I want to buy my own cars. Send us fifty dollars. We'll send out a thousand cars. Get the cars out in your neighborhood. Let people know we're out here. Uh, so that other other people who have a need of deliverance and healing of, of of any type of blessing, they can tune in, listen to one of the program hosts, and be blessed by the word of the Lord for their life. They can have a life-changing experience through worship center radio. So there are ways. We don't want people to get a, a stomp or um, paralyzed in what to do because they don't have money. We're not a money-driven focused ministry. Amen. We are a soul-driven focused ministry. Amen. So there are ways that you can help us even get the word of God out. We, I, I, I'm a, I know I'm going to go on a song about souls. We do need the finances, but our hearts is soul. For Amen. every soul that's Amen. brought into the kingdom, for every backslider that's that right. come back, for every uh, right. uh, heart that's healed, for every body that's healed, for every mind that's healed, every healing, every deliverance, that means more to us than anything anything else the money helps true. us to hire people the money helps us to expand but our we are so driven to the point that this upcoming year why and i we had talked about doing a soul -thon. well it now that is gonna be seven days of nothing but souls where people will call in for prayer we'll have speakers on there we'll pray for you a whole network of intercessors that's gonna pray for you and we're looking for a million souls this year to come in the kingdom we're looking to do it i asked why to talk about it he said around in the september the beginning of october he had no idea that that's Sukkot, the Feast of the Tabernacle. Mm. He didn't even know that. God said, look at the calendar. Wow. The Feast of... What better gift can we give the Lord? Amen. Than Amen. souls. Amen. See, that's... We are about people. Yeah. We are a people-oriented company. Hallelujah. I got to say that because Blaine said it. Prophet Blaine said it. Prophet Sterling said it. Why? You can't see him, but he's shaking his head. And I'm definitely saying it. This is about souls. Reaching Amen. souls. So any way you can help us get more... Uh, um, uh, get people connected... All of, we reach all over the world. There isn't a place we don't reach. If, if we don't reach it, it's only because they don't know about us yet. Mm -hmm. But souls, if you can help us with that, that, that my goodness, will be what we need. Hallelujah. Amen. So right now I'm going to ask um, Prophet Sterling to pray. <laughs> uh, that's what the Lord gave me because we're not going to be on here all day. I will be back. I'm going to tell you something. Mm -hmm. I will be back on live stream at 6 o'clock. And I'm going on Periscope at nine, okay? Because I like our different devices that we right. use. So I, it's, Juan said, said again. I'm going on live stream at six o'clock right here from Worship Center Studios, Limestream.com slash twcn. Okay, so livestream.com slash TWCN, okay? I may or may not be back with Prophet Blaine. It depends on what I need him to do next. <laughs> but I and I am going on my personal. Periscope, which is Dr. Rhoda on Periscope, okay? And that's at 9 o'clock. And that's it. That's it. And all we're going to do is replay. Okay, so we, this is our 24 hour. We want a 24 hour miracle. We know God can Amen. do it in 24 yes, hours. He, can. Yes, he, he can. can provide all of our needs according to his riches and glory in Christ Jesus. Our needs can be supplied. In Amen. 24 hours. Amen. We got some things we need to take care of in yeah, 24 hours, okay? But our main thing, do not hesitate to give them a praise for us. 
this is what we're doing. Three times we're coming on and that's it. Three is divine manifestation. The rest of that time, these programs will circulate. So then our listeners in Africa, our listeners in Europe, our listeners in China, they all can hear it in the middle of the night because Amen. I have wine reprogramming in the middle of the night. Okay. That's it. But that's our 24 hours because we're not going to be here all day big. Because we don't have to be. The Bible said, I've, read, I've never seen the righteous forsaken, nor the seed mm-hmm. begging bread. I Amen. am a seed of the righteous. So we don't believe that. We don't believe that. All right. It's an invitation to bless and prophet is gonna pray wow i'm just so glad that you've asked me to do this um i was going to ask you if i could pray so i'm glad that <laughs> the lord you know, said God let him has pray on, has this on one accord yes so lord god we just come to you right now and we just thank you for this day we thank you for the things that you have planted in front of us um and we come to you humbly with an expectation of a manifestation for your glory in this place lord god we will seek your face lord god and First, before we do anything else, and we know all these things will be added unto us, Lord God, you are our heart's desire, and you desire souls to be brought into the kingdom, Lord God, and that's what we desire to do for you, Lord God. I thank you for the individuals that you have placed in in their hearts, the, the willingness and the alt to, to give to Worship Center Radio. I thank you for just laying on their hearts the amount laying on their hearts what they should do as far as whether it's time, whether it's financial, whether it is equipment, whether it's a connection, whether it's a share, whether it's a praise, whatever you're laying on their heart, Lord God, I pray that um, they do that and that they are obedient. I just thank you right now for the obedience of your kingdom, Lord God. I thank you for their willingness to hear your voice, Lord God. I thank you for the programs and the, the the vision that you have given us and the things that are to come throughout this year and the years to come, Lord God. I thank you for the movies. I thank you for yes, the 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 education and the knowledge and the wisdom that will go over the airwaves through the umbrella of Worship Center Network and everything. I thank you for the lives and the souls yes, that are coming into the kingdom for the work that you have given us to do. And I pray... Um, that it will that this twenty four hour, um, this twenty four hour um, um, program will will bring forth the fruit that you have called it to bring forth, Lord God. I thank you for each individual on this station who takes time out of their day to um, listen and to um, seek your face and then give the word that you have given them. And I thank you for this in time move that you are doing within the kingdom because we know that this is the end time and that you are doing some amazing and wonderful works, Lord God. I pray over every seed that comes in and I ask that you bless it and give them a, a double fold of their of their, um, of their their seed, Lord God, and a quick manifestation. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 We love you. We thank you. Again, I will be on live stream uh, dot com slash TWCN at 6 o'clock tonight and my own periscope at 9 o'clock okay just to share some testimonies do some worship have some fun okay Amen. and then after that we just incre- encourage you to continue to share Prophet Blaine and myself will be back on End Time Move of God next Tuesday at 3 o'clock on this station Worship Center Radio Detroit God bless you God bless you